What's up guys, I'm currently in Las Vegas today for the Adidas Level 3 event, but that does not stop the heat check. And I've got some good news and some bad news. On the bad news, well, those Nike trainers that you were expecting to cop this weekend, well, Nike pushed them back about a month or so. But on the good side, there's a ton of great stuff still dropping this week. Let's start the show. <laughs> Welcome to the Heat Check, I am your host, Jacques Slade, and we're gonna kick off the show with a sneaker that I think a lot of you are gonna be really excited about, especially if you play basketball. It's the Adidas Crazy Explosive 2017. These are priced at $150, just like the last model, but the new model has a few upgrades. There is a bit more cushioning on the inside, which I personally like, and they do fit a little snugger. These are dropping this week in a few different colorways with the white and the gray dropping at finish line for $150. Now, Puma has been creating some highly sought after looks lately and the latest round doesn't seem to be slowing down at all. The brand has been doing a lot with their trainer styles and not making them look like ordinary sneakers, but instead giving them a lifestyle flair. This week, there are four or five different versions of the Puma Fierce dropping and that they range in price from $110 to $120. You can grab all of those over at finish line right now. All right, getting back to Adidas, they are dropping the Swift Run. Now, this model hasn't been getting a ton of love over on the blogs, but it is a very nice looking shoe. Uh, these are gonna be available over at Finish Line in two different colorways, and the pricing is only $85, which is a very good deal. Now, one of the shoes that I've been trying like crazy to get my hands on is actually dropping today, the Mars Yard 2.0. These are going to be releasing at very select locations here in the US and are going to be extremely hard to get. They're gonna cost you $200 if you can actually find yourself a pair. Now, Nike is continuing to collaborate with different people and this time we see Klot turn his creative eye to the Nike Vapor Max. Now, this version of the shoe is super limited and they actually already dropped in a few places but it looks like it's going to get a wide release in Europe starting on Friday. Pricing for those is $200 with a US release date coming later in August. Now, if you are a fan of the Air Force One, the shoe is dropping in a mid-height style on Friday as well. This is the SFAF one, which makes it a more military-inspired look for the shoe, and it's gonna cost you $160 in the black and cargo khaki colorway, which has also been called Hazel. Now, one of the more recent releases from Jordan Brand is the Air Jordan 31 Low. Dropping on Friday, we're going to see the model in a black and metallic gold colorway. The model is basically all black for that fly weave on the upper with touches of metallic gold on the midsole and on some of the detailing. These actually look really nice if you're into the Jordan brand styles and those are gonna cost you $160. All right, now jumping ahead to Saturday, we only have two really big releases, which is actually strange for a Saturday. Coming up first is some love from Nike Sportswear on the Nike Air Foam Posit 1 in the eggplant colorway. This is one of the cooler colorways of the Foam Posit, in my opinion, and this release uh, for the Foam Posit is obviously a re-release from before. Those are gonna cost you $230 for that iridescent look on that upper. Also dropping on Saturday is the Air Jordan 11 Low IE in the Obsidian colorway. This is one of the shoes that Jordan brand hasn't been dropping like crazy, and this particular colorway, the shoe looks really nice. They've had like black and red versions, but this Obsidian version really pops to me for some reason. Uh, this is obviously not the regular Air Jordan 11 Low. There is no patent leather. It has the IE version of it instead, and those are gonna cost you $170, and again, you can grab those on Saturday. All right, guys, as with every week, there is probably a ton of other stuff dropping, but I just wanted to hit you guys with the stuff that I thought you would definitely be paying attention to. With that being said, make sure you like, favorite, and subscribe. That way you know whatever's popping right here on the channel. And also check below for links to all the sneakers that I talked about in the video today. I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line. And as always, guys, I appreciate you. I'll see you soon. Peace.